think about the wonder of life on Earth, it's easy to focus on big, flashy displays of muscle, flesh, and bone that can blow you away with their power and size. Yet there's so much more going on here than what you can see from the grandstands. I'm talking about the hidden array of microscopic machinery that keeps that bull jumping and the cowboys hanging on for dear life. Yep, molecules and cells are the real stars of this rodeo and of everything else in the living world. Let's take a closer look. A human body contains trillions of individual cells, and the largest, on average, are about two one-thousandths of an inch wide. After entering a skin cell, we discover that it's filled with molecular machines, crucial to the survival of all life on Earth. The genetic instructions needed to build these remarkable mechanisms are stored here, in the nucleus, the command center of the cell. Inside, we find 46 flexible strands of chromatin, each made of proteins and the macromolecule DNA. Every rung in this molecular ladder is part of the blueprint required to construct and repair the cells, tissues, and organs in a human body. The color of your eyes, the ligaments in your toes, your strong and flexible skeletal system, the magnificent circuitry in your brain. Every biological detail of who you are is spelled out in the genetic code of your DNA. If we could remove, uncoil, and align end to end each double helix molecule locked within the chromatin fibers of a cell nucleus, we discover more than six linear feet of DNA. Packing that much genetic material into a nucleus that's more than 140,000 times smaller than the head of a pin would be like trying to stuff 24 miles of thread into a single tennis ball. But how is that degree of miniaturization possible in a container so impossibly small? The answer is revealed in a spectacular feat of molecular engineering. First, proteins called histones attach themselves to the long DNA strands. Then, like the line on a fishing reel, every DNA molecule is wound and spooled tightly again and again until it is compacted at least 10,000 times from its fully extended length. These condensed coils ultimately form the chromatin strands that fill most of the nucleus. The biological systems that empower our remarkable physical abilities are truly extraordinary. And as a finale to this brief excursion into the molecular world, let's calculate the amount of DNA that's packaged so efficiently into our bodies. Using conservative estimates, we'll multiply six feet of DNA per cell times three trillion nucleated cells, each with a full supply of genetic code. That's 18 trillion feet, or nearly three and a half billion miles of DNA stored and processed in the cells of just one human being. Now, a huge number like that requires some context, so think about it this way. Our sun is approximately 93 million miles from Earth. So, if we have 3 billion miles of DNA compressed within our cells, then we each possess enough of the living code to stretch from Earth to the Sun and back again more than 18 times. The engineering necessary to organize and package our DNA 
is just one of countless biological marvels that make life possible. For every cell in our bodies depends upon an extensive network of complex molecular machines working together in precise harmony. Most of these mechanisms are too small to be studied without the aid of powerful technologies. Yet each bears the clear imprint of purpose, foresight, and a designer of incomparable vision and skill. The implications are obvious. As human beings, we are more than the accidental convergence of time, blind chemistry, and undirected natural processes. Much more. 